Hi, I'm Tana, and welcome to your meditation for forgiveness. This is something we all need to do on a regular basis. There's a reason that the Bible says we need to forgive 70 times 7. There are things or people that we, we might want to forgive, but it's hard to forgive, or we think we have forgiven, but it keeps popping up. So if you have something like that, that is creating roadblocks in your life, because that is what it does. If things are not happening for you, if things are not manifesting for you the way you want, you're doing the work, you're doing the actions, you're doing your affirmations, you're visualizing, things are not happening, there's usually something you need to release, let go of, and forgive. So we're going to work on that today, and you can come back to this as often as you need to until that thing, that memory is dissipated and is no longer standing in your way. So get comfortable, take a deep breath in, close your eyes, let it out. Feel your body relax as you keep breathing. Breathe in, breathe out. Deep breath in. Feel a beautiful golden light relaxing your body, starting at the top of your head, coming down over your forehead, over your ears, over your nose, your mouth, your chin, and down your neck and relaxing your neck, over your shoulders, feel your shoulders drop as it goes down to your arms and over your chest and your abdomen, down over your hips, down your thighs, and the knees, over your calves, through your feet, and down into the earth. We're gonna to connect to that beautiful core energy. Send it all the way to the center of the earth. And that intense, peaceful, grounding energy, we're connecting with that there. And then we're bringing it back up through the earth, to our body, through our feet, up to your heart, let it land in your heart and breathe into it for a moment. Feel yourself grounded and then allow that light to go up, up your body, through the top of your head, shining out, showering down around you like a fountain, beautiful light, just encompassing you, relaxing you, just feel yourself go deeper with this beautiful light and with this grounded connection. Now I want you to think about a person or a situation that you have had a hard time forgiving, or maybe there's something that seems unforgivable, but you would like to forgive and let go and release it. Think of that thing I want you to really focus on it. Get it in your mind. There might be more than one. If there are a lot, come back and do this meditation for each one so you can focus your full attention on it and work on releasing it and letting it go and getting it out of your way. So once you have a clear idea of what that thing is, that person, that situation, that past traumatic event, whatever it is, I want you to put it into a pink balloon. It doesn't matter how big it is. It doesn't matter if it, if it has physical aspects. If it's just an idea, just a memory, put it in a pink balloon. And the balloon can be as big as it needs to be to encompass this thing. And it's sealed in the balloon. It's sealed in there now. And you're holding on to that with a string. I want you to let go of the string and see that pink balloon floating up, up and away. I think at one time we've all lost a balloon or seen a balloon in the sky that somebody lost and it's floating away. It's going higher and higher. Just watch that pink balloon get smaller and smaller, going higher and farther away until it's just a dot in the sky. And then it just dissolves. It is just gone. 
it is eliminated, it is evaporated, it no longer exists. So just know that whatever you put into that pink balloon is gone. Feel the lightness in your body because you have released it. Feel how good that feels. Feel into your heart. Feel how much lighter and more joyful your heart feels now that you have released this thing. And I just want you to sit with that lightness for just a moment. Doesn't that feel good? Know that you have lifted an obstacle that has been in your way, that has been keeping good things from coming to you, whether it's relationships or opportunity or success or money or experiences, whatever you have been wanting that has not been happening, you have just released one of the biggest obstacles or mainly the only obstacle, could be the only obstacle. And just notice how great you feel. Your path ahead of you is wide open. You are now available to receive love and abundance, joy, fulfillment, anything that you've been wanting. And just let this warm, we're gonna go back to pink, warm, fuzzy pink feeling spread throughout your body. That's that love that is just flowing freely now because you released the stuff that was in the way. Okay, I'm gonna count you back up to a full state of consciousness, knowing that you are in this new beautiful place of love and light and fulfillment, and your path is clear, your way is clear. No more roadblocks, no more obstacles. So keep breathing. And we're going to start with one, slowly coming back up, two, raising up to a higher state of consciousness, three, coming back up out of this, four, rub your hands together, wiggle your fingers and toes. When I reach five, you're going to open your eyes, feeling fine, feeling wonderful, feeling better than before, wide awake, five. Open your eyes. How do you feel? Do you feel that lightness? You can come back and do this anytime stuff resurfaces because usually with stuff that we are trying to release, we want to forgive, maybe we don't want to forgive, but you definitely want to release it, I'm sure. Come back to this as often as it takes because a lot of this stuff has been there for a long time. And you can use this on stuff that is long-term or something that just happened recently. Obviously, the stuff that happened more recently might clear up a little bit more quickly. But if you are working on releasing something that is a lifelong issue that you have been holding on to and telling the same story and being angry about and talking about and regurgitating over and over and over through the years, it is time to stop that. Do this until it is completely released. Be patient with yourself. If it takes many times, if it takes 70 times seven, be patient with yourself. It's okay. You will release it. You will get there. And even if it's not completely released in one session, you'll feel the difference and you'll start to see little things show up in your life. The things that you have been wanting will start trickling in or it might come in in avalanches of abundance. Wait and see. Depending on how much you've released and how open you are now, that's how much you're going to receive. So just know you might make slow progress, but you're making progress and you're moving forward. And you're now allowing yourself the space when you've released that stuff to allow the good stuff in that you want. So I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know, leave your comments below. Let me know if there are any other topics you would like me to cover in a future meditation. Thank you for joining me. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time.